also, but on top of just normal traffic this evening, mm -hmm. there is going to be heavy rain. So give yourself even more time than you think you need to get to AmFam if you're headed to that concert. And plan for slower commutes this morning and then again this evening. Rain not quite to southeastern Wisconsin just yet. There are a few showers around across our northern and western counties, but it's all of this rain that's off towards our southwest that's headed this way. This low pressure system eventually slides south of our area. So heavy rain north of the system as well. That's what we can expect, not just this morning, all day long. Radar pretty quiet across southeastern Wisconsin. Fond du Lac getting a little bit of rain. Watertown, Johnson Creek likely seeing some showers. Oconomowoc maybe starting to see showers here in the next 15, 20 minutes. But the heaviest rain right now is off to our west. It's moving in, though, to our area, likely during the morning rush hour. So as we head towards 9 o'clock, rain a lot more widespread across the area. Heavy rain is likely at times through this morning and afternoon. And we could have a few isolated storms. The severe threat is not zero, but it is very, very low today. Expect impacts to your morning and evening commute, but the biggest concern with the rain is the potential for some flooding. Most of us see an inch, inch and a half to two and a half inches of rain, but there is a chance if we start to see some training or storms sitting over the same place, we could have a few isolated totals over three inches. So you can see a lot of rain on the forecast precipitation. This is for the next three days, but most of this falling over the next 12 to 24 Four hours. Three inches is possible in some places. There is a flood watch in fact in effect from seven o'clock this morning until eleven o'clock at night. And it is a concern for flash flooding, especially in urban areas that don't have great drainage. So certainly something to watch. Of course, if you encounter a flooded roadway, you never want to drive through it. Let's time out this rain chance on Futurecast. This is 7 o'clock. Notice Milwaukee, the lakefront, still pretty dry, but just off to our west. The rain is moving into the metro area by 9, by noon. We are seeing heavy rain across much of southeastern Wisconsin. There is a lot of red on Futurecast. That is really heavy rain that sticks around through the late morning into the early afternoon. By 5 o'clock, this model starts to dry us out, but I think still some pockets of heavy rain will be around the area through 6 or 7. We finally dry out for good overnight tonight. Notice the clouds start to dissipate. Sunshine is back tomorrow, so it's one rainy, cool, windy, gloomy day. The good news is we really do need this rain across southeastern Wisconsin. 64 in Brookfield from our camera at Jilly's Car Wash at 70 in Milwaukee. That's out at my ad, but temperatures do not change too much as we head through the day today. For a lot of us, it's going to be a struggle to get into the 70s this afternoon. Heavy rain and wind. Today is an impact day. Expect some slower drive times this morning and afternoon. Dry, still cool tomorrow. Highs in the 70s. 80s on Wednesday. Another chance for storms Wednesday night into Thursday and then we heat up for the weekend.